Hello guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you or discuss with you Test Gorilla tutorial for beginners. So if you're interested, let's start our tutorial. So you may be applying for jobs or different jobs here and you might be wondering how do you actually uh, do a test or assessment in Test Gorilla? Because we all know that Test Gorilla is a cool platform which in this case uh, gives uh, clients or companies the ways on actually testing or assessing different candidates. Now you might be nervous to take your first test here. Now in this case, uh, taking a test in Test Gorilla is actually pretty easy. So the first thing you need to do here is you need to look out for an email for Test Gorilla. So you typically you should receive a invite regarding uh, this specific test here. So just to give an example, we have this email here. Now typically the email will contain the information about the company and some quick steps and guides on what to do here and what are the things you should remember when you're taking the ch uh, test. Now in this case, typically the uh, actual email has a button here that says go to assessment or a link that is at the very bottom. Now typically by clicking on the go to, as to assessment section here, it will redirect you to another page. In this case, you could just basically start getting or completing the assessment. Now typically the assessment itself might consist of multiple tests so be prepared for that. In this case, once you've completed your test or in just in case uh, if the link or the go to assessment link does not work, you could actually copy the link at the very bottom here as you can see and basically just paste it on your URL just in case this doesn't work or this link does not work. Because in this case, once you click on that link, it should redirect you to the immediate testing page. Now, once you've uh, clicked on the link and complete the whole test, it's going to actually ask you to provide some information about yourself, just uh, just related to the assessment. Like for example, some personal information like your first name, your last name, your pronouns, your country, your experience, a CV and resume, if you have those, and even your work experience, they will be asking about it. In this case, just provide all those details and from here on, you should be able to create your profile. So they might also ask you for your email as well as your password that you want to use it for now in this case that's how you start using uh, uh um the test gorilla platform here for on um, test taking or assessments whenever a company actually asks you now in this case you might be wondering what are the other requirements here so it has it is actually recommended that you use the latest version of your browser whenever you're taking tests or assessments in test gorilla just to make sure that nothing goes wrong now also it requires um some access to your cookies so make sure to allow cookies as well as permissions to use your camera now typically your browser has a uh, drop down at the top left here so usually on your url section you should be able to see your permissions there and just click on allow camera if you have it in this case once you've allowed out you should have you shouldn't have any problems with your uh, assessment here and test grill now, by the way, in their platform, when you go to the uh, official website here, they also have the job board here. If you want to apply for different jobs here, like accounting specialist, magical B2C sales consultant. In this case, you can just basically search for a job that you want to apply for. But in this case, this platform or this section of this page here in Tesco is still in beta. So expect some minor difficulties. Uh, but in this case, uh, you should be able to start using the platform itself. But in this case, that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.